हेलो एवरीवन टुडे आई विल एक्सप्लेन फॉर क्लास एट चैप्टर फोर्टीन एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट थ्री क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव फर्स्ट पार्ट वाई स्केयर प्लस सेवन वाई प्लस टेन एंड वी हैव टू डिवाइड बाय फाइव प्लस फाइव now previous sum you have seen we can cut the factor but here we can't cancel this y plus फाइव so you think how we factorize this we will use here split the middle term first we will solve this y square plus सेवन y and plus टेन you have to think about two number then we add we get सेवन and when we multiply we get टेन so you have think you have thought the number फाइव and टू I will write y square plus फाइव y plus टू y and plus टेन now I will make the pair of टू two, two terms y square plus फाइव y Take y as a common. Y plus five. Now these two terms, two y plus ten, you take two as a common, and internal you will get y plus five. Now these are product of two numbers. These are product of two numbers, and y plus five is common. You can take y plus five as outside. And internally, you will left with y plus two. You can solve this part separate. And now y square plus seven y plus ten is equal to y plus five and y plus two. I will give this equation one. Now y square plus seven y plus ten. I will write this one. Y plus five. y plus 2 and divide by y plus 5 now you can cancel y plus 5 with y plus 5 and your answer will be y plus 2 now next sum m square minus 14 m minus 32 and you have Divide by m plus two. I will write m plus two here. Same we have done first part. I will solve this numerator. M square minus fourteen m minus thirty two. Here we will use the split the middle term because it is not a perfect square. So we will use split the middle term. So you have think about two number. When we add by adding, we will get minus fourteen. But when we multiply, we will get minus thirty two. Sixteen to the thirty two. You know that. But by adding, we should get minus fourteen. So you should take minus sixteen and plus two. M square minus sixteen M. Plus two m minus thirty two. Why? Because minus sixteen and plus two. When you add, you will get minus fourteen, and minus sixteen multiply two, you will get minus thirty two. Understood? Now we will make the pair. M minus sixteen m. You take m as common. M minus sixteen. And here you will take two as a common, and here m minus sixteen. Now m minus sixteen, m minus sixteen. These are product of two. These are product of two, and you can take as common m minus sixteen. M will be left, and plus two will be left. I will give this equation one. M square minus fourteen m minus thirty two is converted into these two factors. Then I will write here m minus sixteen 
and m plus 2 m plus 2 and here you can mention this you can solve separate and then equation 1 here mentioned ki from equation 1 you have changed this by these two factor mention every reason in exam and now m plus 2 and m plus 2 is cancelled and your answer will be m minus 16 now next part 5p square minus 25p and plus 20 you have to divide by p minus 1 first we will solve this 5p square minus 25p and plus 20 if you see in these three terms 5 is common you will take 5 as common p square minus 5p and plus 4 because it is a not a perfect square we will split the middle term 5 will be remain here and now you have to think about two number when we multiply we get 4 but when we add we get minus 5 have you thought about this number we can write minus 4 and minus 1 this two number when we add minus 4 plus minus 1 you will get minus 5 but when you multiply minus 4 into minus 1 you will get plus 4 we will replace split the middle term and in place of minus 5p we will write minus 4p minus p and plus 4 now long bracket these two pair I will take p as a common p minus 4 and if nothing is common you can take 1 as a common but I am taking minus 1 so that the p will plus and this 4 will be minus now p minus 4 and p minus 4 is common p minus 4 you take outside and p minus 1 we left with equation 1 now 5 p square and minus 25 p plus 20 which is equal to this 3 factor i will replace this 5 p minus 4 and p minus 1 and divide by p minus 1 p minus 1 and p minus 1 will be cancelled 5 p minus 4 we will do fourth part 4 y z z square plus 6 z minus 16 and you have to divide by 2y z plus 8. First we will solve this numerator. In play, I will solve only this z square plus 6z and minus 16. Same split the middle term. This middle term will be split into two number. By multiply we get minus 16 and if we add we get 6. You can take two number as 8 and minus 2. When you add 8 and minus 2, you will get minus 6. But when you multiply 8 and minus 2, you will get minus 16. And by adding, you will get 6. So you can write z square minus 8z. 8z we have to take plus because 8 is plus and minus 2z and minus 16. Now take z as common. z plus 8. Take minus 2 as a common. z plus 8. Now z plus 8 and z plus 8 you can take common. z plus 8 and internal you will get z minus 2 and give this equation 1. Now you can replace this only z square plus 6z. First you will write 4yz. And in this place, you will write z plus 8 and z minus 2. And you can mention from equation 1. 
and here 2y z plus 8 z plus 8 and z plus 8 will be cancelled now y and y will be cancelled 2 to z and your answer will be 2z into z minus 2 that will be your answer now next part now fifth part first i will solve this 5pq and p square minus q square we will use identity a square minus b square a plus b into a minus b in place of p square and minus q square i will write p plus q and p minus q 2p p plus q p plus q and p plus q will be cancelled this p and p will be cancelled 5 by 2 q p minus q that will be your answer now next part 12 x y and this 9 x square we will write as 3 x whole square and 16 y square 4 y whole square here 4 x y 3 x plus 4 y same identity a square minus b square is equal to a plus b and into a minus b we will use here 12 xy 3x plus 4y 3x minus 4y this and this you can cancel xy xy 4 3 z 3 into 3x minus 4y will be your answer. Now next part. 39. Now 39y scale. And 50 y square minus 98 you can take 2 as a common. Here you write 2. Forty-nine. Now here we will use identity. 39 y square into 2. And here we write 5 by whole square minus 7 whole square. Divide by 26 y square 5 by plus 7. 39 y square into 2 a square minus b square which is equal to a plus b into a minus b. We will write 5 by plus 7 and 5 by minus 7 26 y square 5 y plus 7 5 y plus 7 and 5 y plus 7 will be cancelled and y square and y square will be cancelled 2 here will be 13 and 13 3 is your answer will be 3 into 5 y minus 7 so you have to remember split the middle term this topic and we have used one or two identities and hope you will understood thank you